Right, so this is a PMR experimenter kit. Tubes in here. But uh, what you first want to do is get some of this stuff out of here and move the tape along the outside of the, uh, you know, the frame here. tape is along the inside and outside. A little sticker there. BNC connectors. This will eventually plug into your signal generator or PFG. Hopefully you got one of those. And this is one of the screw mounts for the coil. So I'll kind of put this stuff off to the side here. Power supply will go on absolutely last. These are the tube mounts. Tube sits right on here. Yeah, four. So little zip ties. The little zip ties are for this. It's tandem zip ties. These, these six inch ones. These will be for this piece right here which also has double sided tape on it. So it's kind of a redundancy but makes it a little bit tougher. And these go on the ends of the tubes. Spin these little nuts off here. This is the fuse. I don't know if that will, uh, really, yeah, it's a duplicate fuse, so you don't have to go out when this one breaks if you run the wrong frequency on it or something. Just get some pliers and clip that one off.
this is what will be tied around uh, the end of this tube right there yeah So this is double-sided tape on here. This will have to be removed. One second. Yep. If you see on here, there's just some little holes, and you'll just place it up as good as you can. Lay one side down, and lay the other side down. Give it a good press seal, right? This is doubly extra fun. Zip tight. 
tie through there. And of course it doesn't quite fit.
this is basically everything. Um, Quartz Pulse Tech Tube. You just try to make those things about as even as you can. These wires get wound around here. Actually, you know what I like to do is Give it a nice little wrap like that if you can around it. We do not like the size of these caps. It's got to be something. Yeah, the frequency range on this is going to be about 500 hertz to 20,000 hertz. Power supply plugs in right here. This is going to be my BNC output from my P3 Pro, which I'll give it signals, give it information, you know, switching rates.
And that is that's the plasma. It's running 880 hertz. Uh, when I switch to the other screen to you know operate it, it um, does shut it off for a second. It stops the video if you notice the pause there. I wish the room was a little bit darker. light really a beautiful looking plasma I ran these things for you know 24 hours straight so this is the option it's the cheapest option from pulse technology it's under a thousand bucks I think everyone should definitely have one uh, getting up to 30,000 hertz range is no small feat and it's no joke. I just have the end caps to put on in this little thing and it took me about 20 minutes. <laughs> 